Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics. Today we have an interesting integral. We have integral from 1 to plus infinity of dx over x square, and we need to find information about this integral, if this integral coincides or diverges. So, how can we solve it? Take a look. We can write this integral as g, g plus infinity, so let's write it as g plus infinity, and as a result, if we need to find a information about this integral about diverging or coinciding so we need to write this integral as limit b approaches to plus infinity so first of all you need to write that b equal to plus infinity this substitution as you can see b approaches to plus infinity then our integral will be from 1 not to plus infinity but to b and as you can see from our function dx our over x square. So take a look. We write our limit and our substitution. This is two things you need you need to know. What are we going to do next? <coughs> take a look. This is our simple case because we all know that derivative of one over x, so if you are talking about derivative, it will be equal to one minus one over x square. So to find in this derivative we need to put minus and this limit of course b approaches to plus infinity of 1 over x, because if we find the derivative of this 1 over x, it will be minus 1x square. We have 1x square over x square, and we with this minus will be plus. So this is good for us. We find every integral, and we need to find to put 1 and b as well. And let's find our integral. We will have that minus limit b approaches to plus infinity. This is our limit, and of course we need to put 1 over b as well the top 1 over b and minus minus 1 and if you're talking about the limit we need to plug in this infinity first of all in instead of this b we will have 1 over infinity will be 0 so 0 minus 1 will be minus 0 minus 1 and if you simplify this we will have that our limit will be equal to 1 so we can write it the our integral going coincides. So this is our our solution. First of all, write in limit of our integral, put a substitution, in our case it will be b, and of course you need to find our integral as well. So if you still have any question, write a question in the comment, write your suggestion in the comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.